Good morning, you guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to show you some things that I got from the 99 cent only stores. And um, I got a, it's like my mornings now since Asia just been going to school. It's been in a rush. It's been like a rush for everything. And I have to make time for, you know, of course, myself in the morning time. So, and you guys, because I want to show you this, um, these 99 cent items that I bought. From the 99 cent only. Um, anywho, you guys. Okay, so let's start off with this V8 Splash smoothie that I got. It was in the fridge because I didn't want it to go bad. But I got this V8 Splash um, smoothie. Um, smoothies. And this is the mango peach one. Um, I like to, just a little tips. I like to dilute it sometimes with a little bit of water or... If it's for me, I dilute it with like a little bit of water so that it can not be so thick or I dilute it with a little bit of apple juice if it's for Ashton because he can't drink that thick, like, you know, smoothie type of stuff, stuff, um, but he can't drink like thick smoothies. So I try to dilute it with, you know, water, uh, water or apple juice, um, so that, you know, the kids can drink, um. But anyways, I got this. I just seen these on TV as a commercial. I don't know if they are not selling or what. But these are the Yo Play um 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 <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm like tongue tied right now. The Yo Play yogurts and this is the Ulta Fitcher plain. It's like 17 grams of protein, one gram of sugar, and it just got YQ, which is Yo Play. So, I guess they are healthy for you. So, I gave, grabbed myself like three, like I think two of these because I've never tried it. And then I also grabbed some Chobani because 99 cent store is like going crazy over Chobani yogurts. And like every time I go there, it's like always stocked with different kinds of Chobani. So, I wanted to grab this Chobani, a hint of wild berry. I love berries. Uh, and so I just wanted to try it out. And I haven't really tried it yet, but I'm going to try it today and see how I like it um, at work. Um, it's going to be like one of my breakfast items. And then I'm going to probably drink one of these Naked Press um, Blend of 7 Juice. I got that at 99 as well. This is a bowl beet. That's what it's called. And it has beets, carrots, cucumber, apple, lemon, orange, and ginger. And they are 130 calories. And let's see how much sugar it has. Oh, wow. 25 grams of sugar, but I'm um, still going to drink it. Though. Um, so, anywho, this is going to be part of my breakfast, too, as well. Because, like I say, my life now is, like, on the go. You guys, I dyed my hair yesterday. It's, like, supposed to be, like, a copper, but it didn't turn out that way. But I just really like the way that it turned out. Um, so, anywho, I should have showed you guys, but I just didn't have time. Um, so, um, what else? I thought I dropped something on the floor, but I don't think it did. So, um, I found these little Kerr's um, mini cubic cubes of um, garlic. <clears throat> and I got two of those and so in the inside it has like little packs of garlic I'm going to show you guys because I thought it was just the cutest thing ever um, and it's really loud so if you like garlic yeah so I'm going to like add those to my meats and stuff when I'm marinating them um, I'm going to start doing um, when I do my meal prep I want to start doing like go-to meals, um, quick meals during the week, so I can just take it out the freezer, um, throw it out, put it in the oven, and go, because that's, like, my life right now, um, what else do I have, so, yeah, I have two of those garlic things, and I found some of these, um, I always liked them when I was going to school, but, these Quaker Chewy Variety Packs. They're called Chewies. And it has like two chocolate chips, two s'mores, two peanut butter, and two oatmeals. 
and like now I don't, I'm not really not into it, but AJJ loves them, so I'm gonna put these in his um, lunch box, and I bought two of those. And then the girl ran out of her deodorant. I have to have my deodorant, so I bought some Suave. I normally don't use this kind of deodorant. I mean, I do use the Suave brand, but I use the coconut. Um, I think it's like a coconut island or something like that. But this is the powder one, the 24-hour protection. Um, only reason why I use the um, coconut one, because coconuts, it keeps the cysts from my butt and my arms and stuff like that. And I noticed, like, when I stopped using the coconut one, the cyst comes back under my arm. So, um, I deal with those, like, bumps and stuff under my arms, and it hurts really, really bad. So, I had to go get it, like, lanced and stuff like that. But, <coughs> since I had started using the coconut one, um, which I started buying from the 99 cent only stores, and now it seems like they don't even carry it. So, I have to start finding it, <coughs> like, at the Dollar Tree um, so I'll probably go there today and buy some because I'm not going to buy it like on regular price. But anyway, I bought the powder one and then I bought the um, Tropical Paradise one. Um, this one, it smells really good, but I try to stay away from smell ones because it kind of like, I don't know, like it sends an alert to the sis like time to, you know, Let's grow a cyst under her arm. And girl, it hurts so bad. If you have never had a cyst under your arm, I like I would suggest you just to keep um, wearing your regular deodorant and not constantly switch up deodorants because that's why people tend to get cysts under their arms. But this is the other box of Chewies. And then I bought some of these aluminum wallets because... Um, I was doing a lot of research on the aluminum wallets, and it it's harder for people to steal your um, like um, credit card number. It's harder for people to get your information inside of the aluminum wallets. So, um, for all parents out there that use credit cards on a daily basis, or you know, just be safe and careful, and grab one of these from 99 cent only stores because. These do work. Um, and I use these sometimes for my budgeting too. I put money in different pouches and put like my little um my little paper clip thing, uh paper clip notes um on there and just you know, this is for rent, this is for you know, different things like food and stuff like that. So um that's why I use these sometimes too. So I got one for my credit cards, um, and then I got the pink one which is so cute it looks like a little suitcase but I got this one for my budgeting and I'll probably show you guys well I will show you guys how I do that with one of these but this is what it's called like an aluminum wallet so um it says it's like for men and women so I doubt like I don't know if a man would get a pink one you know but if you do girl go girl go um and then I bought these three packs of lighters. I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this. Like, <sighs> this, it made me kind of upset because when selling lighters in 99 cent on the store, they don't ask for ID. Okay. So if a child walks in there and pick up these and purchase them without ID, that just making them want to go and smoke. It makes them want to do crazy things. So, like, my advice to 99 cent store only is, like, make sure you get an ID on lighters because the, people don't think that lighter is dangerous, but that fluid in there, once it breaks and somebody light it up, it's going to be hell, like, to pay. You know what I mean? Like, a price to pay. And especially, like, kids, I'm sure kids that are, you know, five, six and below are not going to be wanting these because they don't have a mind to. But... You know, um, I just think, feel like they need to ID, like, anything that's dangerous at the 99 cent store. And I asked the cashier, I was like, why you didn't ID me for this? And she said, I wanted to, but I, I'm just ready to go. I'm just ready to go where? Like, are you serious? So if it was, like, a 7 or 8-year-old with this in their hand, you are seriously ready to go? You don't care if they go home and light up a match or something or light up a candle and burn their house down? You don't care if they go somewhere and 
smoke cigarettes or weed at that. I mean, you don't care if they do dangerous and harmful body things with this. Like, seriously, like, get your act together, 99. Like, I love this store, but at the same time, y'all are not IDing people for lighters. And I may be, like, one of those tough parents. Okay, so well be it. But at the end of the day, I want my son to be safe. At the end of the day, I want your kids to be safe. So, you know. But, anywho. Uh, what else did she get? Oh, I got some some progressive chicken broth. And this is the reduced sodium one. Um, I should have got like four of these. But I just didn't want to carry all of these um, in one shopping trip. But um, I realized that they still have them. So I'll probably go and grab some. Um, and I think, I think, yeah, that's it, you guys. Because I don't have nothing else. Yeah, I don't have nothing else. So, anyways, you guys, today is Wednesday, and um, AJJ is headed off to school. I'm going to be doing his lunch, and I'm going to be showing you guys um, Friday his whole weeks of lunch. Um, I'm going to put all that together and show you guys that. And, anywho, you guys, yesterday, I did I vlog yesterday? I don't know if I vlogged yesterday. If I did, you know, I, I'm having mom brain farts. If I didn't, my bad, you guys. It's just I have to regroup everything in my life because AJ just going to school so I have to start planning stuff and putting stuff on his schedule and all that good stuff but I love you guys as always and when I'm not vlogging I miss you guys so 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 much because you do help me with my depression and um yeah so I'll see you guys tomorrow bye